You know there's more space in your life than you think. In fact, in Washington, D.C., two former Marines opened Compass Coffee, a local coffee shop and roaster that uses NASA technology to brew the perfect cup of coffee. Uh, it makes my life better when I drink a really good cup of coffee and to know that NASA technology was involved in making this cup and adding to its quality, I'm, I'm a happy camper. PID, Proportional Integral Derivative, is something NASA developed and really mastered the technology of. We use it for consistency and precision in, in a couple different areas of the business. Roasting, uh, making sure that our time temperature profiles are the same each roast, um, and most fun in the espresso, right? So we're, we're looking at all the previous espresso shots, uh, we're kind of adding them all together to predict how the next espresso shot will pull. And that makes sure that it tastes sweet, like caramel, and that uh, really good when we mix it. NASA engineers have researched proportional integral derivative controllers, or PIDs, to design life support systems. Also in use for that perfect brew, near-infrared abridged spectrometers, the same technology that NASA's aqua satellite uses to collect information about Earth's water cycle, and here we see that tech being used in a metropolitan small business. So we use a machine uh, that uses a laser to measure the amount of quinic acid in the coffee. So quinic acid has a linear relationship with the degree of roast. So as we're trying to figure out the recipes, how do we make each blend taste the same every time? We're measuring those acids with the lasers and constantly evaluating and tweaking the profiles of every roast. From the PIDs used at Compass Coffee to the newly launched ISS Espresso machine on the International Space Station, which for the first time will allow hot liquids like coffee and broth to be available for astronauts to enjoy. So we're small, we're scrappy, we've got to look for tiny advantages to get an edge. Uh, coffee's incredibly competitive. So using this technology allows us to be more efficient, to have a higher quality product, and it really differentiates us from a large company. We're working off the earth for the earth. With NASA technology and our small business programs, helping people dream big as they benefit from our research in space. We live and die on small businesses. I think people have heard me say that before. Um, you know, we celebrate the relationship that NASA has with small businesses during this Small Business Week. Uh, they are the engine of our economy. That's where real jobs are made, uh, and that's what grows the middle class, if you will. There is more space in your life than you think, especially in that next cup of coffee.